understanding duty cycle and thermal overload protection. When you're making a decision on which wire welder to purchase and use, many times duty cycle comes up as part of the discussion. Duty cycle is a term that is used to help you understand a reasonable amount of time that this unit can be used continuously. This time is based on a 10 minute time frame. For example, many of the smaller MIG welders meant for home or light duty use are rated at a 20% duty cycle. That means that during a 10 minute period, you can weld for two minutes. That is, two full minutes of arc on time. Any time that the arc is stopped to reposition material, or inspect the weld, fit up parts, etc., counts towards the eight minutes of rest time. Two minutes of welding is a significant amount of welding time when welding on home projects. If this duty is cycled continuously, meaning that you weld for two minutes and then rest for eight minutes and repeat over the life of the machine, your welder should not deteriorate. This also means that on occasion you may be able to weld for three minutes straight. But if you do that every day, every cycle of duty, your machine will not last as long. Duty cycle should not be confused with thermal overload. The concepts are similar, but not the same. Many MIG welders have a thermostat or thermal relay inside the welder. This senses when the welder's internal temperature is getting too high. If it does get too high, weld output is cut off, but the fan continues to run. If this happens, leave your machine cool for a few minutes and try again. The important thing to remember is that a machine with a 20% duty cycle will not shut down at two minutes. It may, but it may also weld for three minutes, four minutes, or maybe only one minute. This all depends on the temperature you're welding in. Naturally, a welder that's in 100 degree temperatures will heat up quicker than a welder in a 60 degree temperature.